is an athlete at heart, and she went on from throwing right hooks in the boxing ring to doing the quick step and the cha-cha and dancing with the stars. She's also a strong advocate for promoting kids' involvement in sports and athletics. Please welcome knockout Layla Ali. <laughs> Damn you in this body of yours. <laughs> I work hard. Yes, we know, we know. I'm up running at the crack of dawn. I so. heard you run five miles a day. Not every day. Okay. I try to do it at least four times a week, yeah. Well, see, here's my connection with Layla. Um, the last time I saw you, you were on my radio show, and this was years ago, and after the show, you were on your way to do some good old-fashioned New York City shoe shopping, oh, yeah. and you were gonna pick up, I remember you told me, like eight pair of gator heels in various colors. You got a good memory. Yes. I don't even remember that. I can that. even tell you the brand. Gators? Maury. Oh, right. Okay, yes. yeah. I remember they were giving me some shoes. It's okay, a, whatever a it was, you were right. going down to get them. And and then I asked you what size you were, because you and I are the same height, five feet 11. And you said you were size 11. Yes. And I immediately had a mental connection with you, because I also asked mm -hmm. you, you know me, ever inappropriate, how much you weigh. And you told me you weighed 175 pounds. And I said, I weigh 175 pounds. And I remember <laughs> looking at you like really hard and saying, if I, I mean, hers is 175 pound athletic body. Mine is housewife of New Jersey. You, know. you got about 20 pounds carrying around all yeah. that weight up top there. They're nice though, aren't they? <laughs> hey, look. <laughs> I got the athletic boobs too. <laughs> look, I have this. Do you have this? Do you have no, any of this? No. I mean, I have some things. Uh, a yeah. But, yeah. I mean, especially after having a baby. Things happen. So I'm not the and, same. And so congratulations, Thank you. Thank though, you. on the baby. You're a lovely love artist. <laughs> You know, Layla, um, when I when I when I last God. saw you, you were going through um, separation, divorce, whatever it was mm -hmm. in the past. Mm -hmm. She's remarried to that former NFL uh, ball player, and he's a broadcaster, Curtis Conway, and they have little CJ who is just scrumptious. I just want to dip Thank him you. in syrup and eat him up. I miss him. <laughs> yeah, how did you and Big Curtis meet? We have a mutual friend that introduced us, and it was so funny because we actually lived in the same neighborhood, just five minutes away from each other, but we had never met. And I was going through my divorce, and I went over to his house for a fight party he was having, and that's when we met. So, and we've just been hooked up ever since. And now, what neighborhood is this? What city do you live in? I live in Los Angeles, uh -huh. but it's an area in the valley, uh -huh. like Calabasas, Woodland Hills area. Uh -huh. <clears throat> And how long have you guys been married? We've been married now, shh, like going on two years. Go no, it's been two years. No, yeah. we just had our second year anniversary. And my memory is bad from boxing. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, you know what? I, we I call. <laughs> well, I'm like, well, how long have we been married? You've yeah. got, yeah, you've got the double thing because you got the boxing thing. I know you're joking about that. No, girls I'm don't get punched in the head, do they? Girl, yes, it's serious. Really? Yeah. We and fight, then we fight just like men fight. So we fighting women instead of men. And then you, when you have a baby, you know, you push out and you push out half your brain. We call Is it mother's memory. Oh, yeah. Okay. Don't, okay. don't you find you have? Okay, a, I have a double then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you look beautiful on Dancing Thank with you. the Stars. Thank you. And now one of the things, and and she did Dancing with the Stars, by the way, just before she became pregnant. So you got in there, th there she was on the dance floor. Your partner was Maxim. our friend to the show, Maxim. Maxim happens to be tall or able to really hold a girl sturdy. Did he ever at any point flip you up or do any of that? No, you know, yeah. they usually end up putting the taller girls with Max yes. because the dancers are small and I'm, I'm a big girl. But yeah. no, I, there was a lot I couldn't do uh, because of my size. And yeah. I didn't want to do it, frankly. You know, I was, I was like, I'm not trying to be picked up and flipped around and trust that way anyway. Me he didn't want to yeah. carry that weight anyway. Yeah, so. exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he always used to talk about, oh, you're a big chick. I'm like, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what? <laughs> I, I love being a big girl. You know, it's, it's odd, America, and, and Layla knows this, and many girls who are our height, if you're not thin like a supermodel, then you really to kind of get looked at like a little bit of a freak show once you put on your five inch heels because I know you like the heels too. I put them on. I mean, I'm like six two when I put my heels on. But I mean, don't you love it? And then you have to set people straight, you know? Yeah, I don't really have a problem with it. I mean, I think it's all in the way that you carry yourself. You yes. Know? And I carry myself with confidence. And if I feel like wearing heels, I will. But I do look like a giant most of the time on television because most. Uh, people on TV are small. Very small. But I just look at them like you're just small. Yes. 
I'll tell you. you know. Yes, yes. Now, now, Layla is one of what eight children. Yes. How's Dad doing? He's Muhammad? doing very good. He has his good days and his bad days. Yeah. So for the most part, he's doing really well. Yeah. Do you get to see him often? Um, not as often as I would like because we're both busy. Yes. Um, but uh, I see him probably every few months. But I'd like to try to see him more now, especially with my son and his grandson. Do you yeah. live near any of your um, siblings for I, CJ to, you know, get the Ali flavor? I have two sisters that live in Los Angeles, oh, and right? my sister Hannah is my only full sister uh -huh. from the same mother, and gotcha. she's over all the time, yeah. you know. And then my oldest sister, May May. Who I love. Yeah, May May, <laughs> my girl. She comes around as well, so. May May is yeah. really nice. Well, um, I know that one of your big, um, big causes is that you want to get kids more involved with athletics, and I think this is a great thing. They got, keep, tell everybody about what you're doing and why. Well, you know what, I think that, uh, you know, I hear all the problems that we're having with um, childhood obesity, and I see kids running around overweight, and I feel so bad for them, and me being, you know, in the area, obviously, of health and fitness and being an athlete, people always used to come up to me and say, how do you stay fit? You know, how should I eat? What should I do? So I just really started getting involved with it, and, you know, I'm a part of the Women's Sports Foundation. I'm on the Board of Trustees, and we're, our whole goal is to keep girls active through sports um, and also give women a voice, you know, and make sure that we're not discriminated against. I'm also part of the Governor's Council on Physical Fitness. I get involved with campaigns like Subways, Fresh and Fit, anything that has to do I with fitness and kids. On. So you're transitioning from boxing and you're becoming um, a spokeswoman and, and you're putting your, a face to various causes. Exactly. I love that because you're only, what, 31? Yes. Look at that. So she's got her whole life ahead of her. You did wonderful work in boxing. Now you've got your husband and CJ and your causes. I saw you doing hair advertisements as well. I did a couple. I mean, a couple I've of done hair. A little I saw bit of your everything. wedding on the Style Network or something. Oh, yeah. I see well, you're doing you're doing big things. It's really good to see you again. Thank you. And please tell me. You look beautiful, and congratulations thank for everything you. you do. I think I threatened you last time I was on your radio show. What'd I said, you Don't say? you talk about me, or I'll come back up here <laughs> and give me the one two. <laughs> I love this. One. I love you a lot, and thank you. And tell your father I said how you doing. Okay. All right. Log on to WendyShow.com for more information about.